Yes. Um, so this is a song that I wrote um, last year, and um, I just recorded my first album um, a couple months ago, and it's it's being mixed right now. And so this song is on there. And um, I asked Carl if he would play um, a second acoustic part to mine um, on the record, and he said yes, and he sang some harmonies. And um, this is one of my favorite songs to sing. Um, it's called I Wish I Wanted To. And it's, it's a, a great song. Oh, thank yes, you. I love this song. <laughs> I played it on the Opry a couple times. Uh. Um, but yeah, it's a it's kind of a after breakup song. It's that moving on. Um, but sometimes you kind of have to force yourself to get out of the house. <laughs> you still don't want to, so that's why it's called I Wish I Wanted To. <laughs> All right. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. smile in my eye I'm gonna put on my new dress and show it off tonight I wish I wanted to I'm gonna put my phone down try not to call it off gonna meet him at the front door and try to make small talk I wish I wanted to I wish I Great, actually. That's Thank terrific. You. Now, your dad, he didn't write a lot of songs, did he? Not a lot. He wrote a couple, but he mainly was a, he called himself a song doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Take them and make them fit yeah, himself. Like when yeah, he heard, yeah, when he heard Galveston on the radio, he, uh, it was a ballad. I think, was it Don Ho that sang it? I think so. Um, Tiny Bubbles. Um, Johnny Rivers, by the time I get to Phoenix. You uh -huh. know. He was a song doctor. Yeah, I mean, he, he would a... hear stuff and go, I know how to make this Glenn Campbellized. 
<laughs> well, he could, he could have sung the alphabet, and I'd have listened yeah. to it. Yeah. You were absolutely you know, right. Just could, uh, with that voice. Bill, uh, one time long ago, uh, Gene Watson, I asked, uh, I said I'd give up one of my songs if Gene would sing uh, Bitter They Are. Remember, and he did, I'll give up one of my songs, or all of them. Would you sing part of the remembrance song? Oh, sure. That she wrote for your dad. Yeah, absolutely. I, I hope I'm not out of order. As... Uh, I won't say anything else. Just, Rhonda, by the way, your part was beautiful on there. That added to the, the trio sound and, and the mandolin. Great job. This young lady sang this on the, of course, I cry at garage sales. I mean, if it's a good garage sale, it has to be. <laughs> uh, but I, I, I almost literally wept when I heard this tribute that she, uh, for her for daddy. And I'll give it all of my songs today if you'll sing that. Oh, okay. Well, thanks. <laughs> Um, yeah, this is a song that um, I, I put it out um, in 2015 as a single, um, along with the documentary on my dad, Glenn Campbell, I'll Be Me. And um, I wrote this song when I first moved to Nashville, um, because we had just gotten off tour with my dad, and he was starting to decline with his Alzheimer's disease. And I knew that there was going to be a time where he wouldn't recognize me pretty soon, that he wouldn't know who I was. And so, you know, we've always had a really special connection, so I wanted to have something that would maybe be able to reach out to him even when he can't really understand words anymore. Um, and that's definitely music. So this is um, kind of a song from me to him saying that I'll always have his back. It's called Remembering. stairs to your bed Thunder rolls and I pull the covers over my head You say it's just a storm Enjoy the show You take me to the window and you show me that it's beautiful Never had to ask you to sing for me It's just the way Don't you worry. 
story, I'll do the remembering. Daddy, don't you worry, I'll do the remembering. Thank you for asking her to do that. Ashley, that's beautiful. Thank you. It wasn't rehearsed, and Carl just jumped right in there. Thank you all for being here today. Carl, thank you for bringing Ashley and the thank you for kicking back us. with us. Thank you for on, having us. On We're proud to be here. You're thank terrific, you. Ashley. Much good luck to you. Hey, if you like that one, you're going to love this one. Or this one.